Hello and welcome back to Disabled and Prepping. Today I made some pork chops and potatoes for lunch. Um, funny thing is, Kaber ended up getting a, um, a whole pork chop because um, the meat was so tender from cooking overnight that the meat fell on the floor. So she ended up getting a whole pork chop today. Um, she doesn't usually eat my food, but anyways. Um, and then I had the juice with some meat pieces still in it because I cooked it overnight, so it was really super tender, hence the reason it fell on the floor um, while I was taking it out. So anyways, she um, got the pork chop, and I ended up having a little bit of pork chop left and um, some potatoes that I cooked in it. And then I had the juice with, like I said, some of the meat pieces and um, the nice broth. So what I did is I put some rice in there. That's what you see now, is the rice and some meat pieces and the broth. So um, that's going to be my uh, dinner tonight, probably along with um, a vegetable, maybe a vegetable or something that I put in there, um, or I'll put on the side. But um, basically I meet, eat one meal a day. So this is a way that I use up um, some of the juices so I can, um, possibly get us the second meal. Um, not that I'm going hungry, but I just, my stomach just can't handle it sometimes, especially with my dystonia. Um, my muscles cramp up and it causes me to have problems with my stomach. So, um, this is easy on my stomach. Um, so that I'll have that tonight. Um, it might actually be enough for two nights. But that's what it is. Um, that's how I stretch the things that I get. Um, so it lasts me longer. Uh, it may not look that appetizing, but it really is. It's really got some really good flavor. Some, um, I'm going to probably throw some seasonings on it. But this has gone on long enough to show you my dinner. Didn't realize it was that long. I'll stop rambling now. Um, just wish you... A good night. Um, stay safe. Stay warm. Um, and have a great night. Uh, until next time. Bye for now.